Hey, this is Angie of Happy Healthy Vegan. I'm super excited because, check it out, I got a new vegan cosplay. Already very excited. Let's see. So first off, we have coffee bee snackaroons. Dude, I was just looking at these in Whole Foods. They're like $8.49. Ooh, Ryan's not here. Snack on these alone. Okay, I was gonna open the whole thing, but let's just take a little snack and break here. First of all, the smell. Mmm. Mmm. Ho, ho, ho. Bubba wants to see. Oh, Bubba likes coconut. I spy with my little eyes some coffee. Let's see, it's coconut. I see, uh-uh, a coffee mug. Let's get this out here, shall we? If I'm not mistaken, I think this is some kind of like a limited edition mug and it is so light. This is a camping mug. Man, if only I'd had that. <laughs> if only I'd had that on a recent camping trip. Why are you so excited about that? Okay, let's see here. Brewing good. Our tasting notes, spiced red apple with a crisp finish. We donate 10% of our proceeds to animal protection nonprofits. Wow, that's great. Out of Maryland, it looks like. Maybe I should go brew a cup. Guys, I'm coming out of the closet. I am a coffee enthusiast. I wouldn't say that I'm an addict. Rebel Kitchen Coffee, organic coconut milk drink with coffee. Oh, -ho. nothing added, no refined sugar, additives or preservatives. What else we got here? Nature's Dairy-Free Creamer, Nut Pods, original unsweetened, half almond and half coconut. You guys, I literally, just tried this type of a blend at uh, my local coffee shop here. Yes. Well, I guess I would want to pour a little bit of this in this in my coffee cup. Let's continue, shall we? What the heck, you guys? Okay, this is like crazy. Caffeinated peanut butter? Can you imagine if I were to have the coffee cookies and the peanut butter? All right now, things could get cray cray. Oh. Soylent? Okay, I know occasionally we have gotten comments from you viewers asking, what do we think of Soylent? He came up with like a food replacement system, was like no fuss, no mess, all plant-based, to where he had like all of his nutrients included in this easy drink, cause the bro didn't wanna like, he didn't wanna mess around with making food, he just wanted to do more work. This is so trippy, you guys. Okay, so I'm on the Soylent site now, I'm looking up what is coffee is. Uh, soy protein, algal oil, Real lightly roasted coffee. Okay, so there is real coffee and L-theanine, the amino acid L-theanine found in green tea has been found to reduce the jitters associated with caffeine consumption. So I'll have to try this on a morning when I haven't had any food and let you guys know. What else? Drop us in, brew bag, organic ground coffee. Oh, with matcha tea and cacao. That sounds good, they call it balance. This would have been awesome when I was camping, you guys. What else? This looks fun. Fair trade espresso and chocolate with chia flaxseed, gluten and soy free, no refined sugar. Is Swahili meaning to give. Ooh, wow, that sounds really good. I love chocolate too. And there's more. Mushroom coffee with cordyceps and chaga. Chaga is one of those things that seems really popular here in Long Beach. There's a lot of those um, um, superfoods people around here, which is how I originally got into raw veganism was through all these superfoodies around here. Cordyceps, I know I tried that a few years back. I saw this really scary video with cordyceps like grow out of the bodies of insects, but then I saw some vegan people doing it and it turns out that you can also grow it without the use of insects. So I guess I'll give cordyceps another try. So this would also have been good camping. Just a little grab and go. And finally, what have we got here? Organic plant protein, smooth coffee from Garden of Life. If I were to drink all of these caffeinated beverages and eat all this caffeinated food right now, I would be like, whoa, even with the L-theanine. This is a lot of great, awesome stuff in it. it. Smells so good. Hey, Bodhi. All right, so I'm gonna try just a little. You're interested in peanut butter? 
I'll be the judge. So I guess I should mention the brand on the steam. Protein, electrolytes, caffeine. Hmm, it does sound a little on the paleo side. It's gonna be a little naughty. Just dip my finger right in there. And, mm, damn. Okay, so Ryan doesn't do well with caffeine. I guess he gets like extreme jitters. So I'll have to, I'll have to warn him that if he does this peanut butter, he's gonna get caffeinated. Ooh, talk about espresso bean. Okay, just, you know, a little nibble, you know, can't hurt. Looks good, you see all the chia seeds? Mmm, wow. <laughs> All right, I can have his do meat burgers. <laughs> I'll take the vegan cuts coffee box any day. <laughs> so good. <laughs> All right, what the heck? I was gonna let this get cool first, but I just want to try it out. All right, here we go. Oh man. Mm. Wow. Dang, I could have used this at SoCal Veg Fest. Super good. Mm -hmm. Man, today is my lucky day, I'm telling you. That is good. It smells so good. Bobo keeps pushing the camera around. All right, that looks crazy good. Hey, now it's JoJo. What? so much capacity I can't even fill it look at that mm. Mm -hmm. good morning let's try some of this creamer when should I say when <gasps> mm. let's try a little more shall we my dad likes his coffee completely blonde he likes it as light as my pants all sugar and cream All right, that's good. Oh, it smells intense. It definitely has a mushroomy smell. It's definitely gonna need a little more water. This smell reminds me of Sheila G, if you guys have ever had that. Pretty intense stuff. I love to try everything. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed my unboxing of the Vegan Cuts coffee bags. I will have a link for you down below to um, everything else that's in their marketplace. That was something I didn't realize. I thought that Vegan Cuts was simply a monthly subscription box service with the snack box, which we tried last month, and the beauty box, um, which I just got a hold of my first beauty box as well. They also have a makeup box um, I didn't know about that happens not monthly, but four times a year, so quarterly. But then there's this whole marketplace where there's these awesome, you know, one-off boxes that you can um, get any specialized uh, theme. I saw they even have like a bean fields box where it's like you get nothing but bean fields. So there's all these awesome things in the marketplace. So I will have a link to the marketplace in the show notes here so you guys can check it out. Maybe you find some great gift for uh, one of your loved ones this holiday season or just something for yourself because there was a lot of rad stuff in there, I'm not gonna lie. So thanks to Vegan Cuts for sending out this box for me and my fans to check out. It was super fun unboxing this today. Mm. So leave your questions and comments down below. Uh, share this video with a friend um, who's into coffee and into vegan stuff or is looking for a great gift for the holiday season. Um, like this if you're into it and uh, stay subscribed for more vegan reviews and other fun stuff from me and Ryan here at Happy Healthy Vegan. And until next time, keep it vegan, people. Keep it vegan. <laughs>